Greetings, my friends. I'm Mr. Mokalover, and thank you for joining me here in Equestria War, in which this will be the final episode. So, let's go grab some steel. Last time, uh, we went to war with people that we thought we couldn't go to war with people, but, you know, we figured out that we can we can eventually go to war with some people because they cause world tension. But it's about now time for us to go to war with the good people of Wing Body. And we should call all of our allies in and have a, uh, okay time. Don't want to forget doing that. Uh, comment. Or concern was, I always said Barad, Barad, Magrocracy wrong. It's Mageocracy. The Barad, Barad, Mageocracy. And my cat, Binky, is just joining me here, sitting on one of my chairs. Right, Bink? You okay? Sit down. And let us have a good time with the folks of the Kingdom of Wingbody. Which we should do pretty okay. Oh, we are over here. Okay. Do we still have supply issues? Yeah, we still kind of do. That's kind of sucks. That's okay. You guys up north, just kind of hang out for now. Don't worry about it. We'll attack down south soon enough, so not really worried. Let the 40 combat with infantry kind of do most of the damage for now. I think we'll do pretty okay. Are we just finding anyone else right now? Mm, not really. But this guy has goals against uh, Griffinstone, but mm, I don't know about that. Let's see. State of Lake City. We do want to maybe take them out. That'd be kind of fun because, well, they used to be under us, but we want to make sure that they're going to be under us once again. Now, using 40 combat with infantry, we've lost 33,000 people. They've lost 60,000, so almost two to one. Almost. We still got our navy down here, which is very oh, oh very, very nice maybe. Oh, they got some ships. Oh, they're trying to seek our ships too, but our capital ships are doing okay in terms of destroying their navy. If y'all need to, oh, battle cruiser. Do you have enough space? Uh, they sort of do. You guys definitely need another one here. Cool. Let you guys go ahead and repair for now. So far, not too bad. Seemingly, we're probably doing okay. Over here. I still don't want to send all those light tanks yet. I really don't want to. But let's do it anyways and see what happens. Can they pierce us? Probably. Yes, they can. Most of the enemy divisions can. Oh boy, what's going on? Oh, we found enemy battleships. Well, that's not good. We lost two dis ally destroyers. Oh, they're trying to land over here, so be it. Uh, take this off. Everyone go and repair. Because we, do not we can't afford to lose ships. We lost one light cruiser, which is not good. Just go and repair for now. Go and repair. Disengage. Acquire bombers, always good. And we're going to try to finish our focus off here as well. Uh, expand the airships? Sure, why not? The air bases we currently operate lack the necess necessary cap capability to support an air force of the size we wish to create. A push to construct additional runways and hangars should be taking should take care of the problem, which is a good thing. Okay, seriously, guys, I told you to leave. Like, come on. Go home. I mean, they can attack as much as they like, but we've oh, they've lost quite a few guys. They've lost, though, 200,000. That is pretty darn good for us. I think we established the last time they... Oh, they couldn't really... Yep, keep those losses going. That's okay. That's okay for now. These are probably convoys, hopefully, not actual ships. Oh, my goodness. Uh, these are mostly destroyers. I'm not too ready to get destroyed, so... Yeah, go repair. That's what we wanted you to do the entire time. Just just, just go repair. Uh, we've done nothing for naval doctrine, so actually that would probably help, been very, very helpful before we got to war, but whatever. Next time I'll remember that a little bit better. Alright, do you have any upgrades? Tough Bunker. Brilliant Spectre. That'd be good. Anything else here? Not really yet. That's okay. Magnetic Detonator. Suffer less losses, please. That'd be very good. I mean, overall, I think we're doing pretty darn well, even though we're taking quite a few losses. That's still okay. You know, things happen. Over here. Supplies. It's just, supply is so garbage. I mean, holy cow. It is so bad. Oh! I mean, yeah, we can't really push that well when they have... Really, when they We have really bad supply, but at the same time... Oh man, we're racking up the casualties. Holy cow. That's insane. They can't do anything. The more losses they take, I mean, they can't do, make up for them, so. The infantry seem to be doing pretty well, though. But my goodness, supply is just garbage. Go, go, go. Ships repairing, that's fine. All these losses, that's fine, you know. In the end, it won't really matter. War bonds, we need more political... Uh, not political power, but war support if we want to do that again. Ace pilot promoted. Very good. Very good. 
Other people should be getting more upgrades soon enough. Hey, we cut these guys off? Not yet. God dang, that sucks. Cut, cut them completely off. Then all these guys will die. And then, Hey, okay, we cut them off right there. Nice. Kill them. Who dares wins? Good, good, good. My goodness. All these heavy guys. If we suffer like half a million casualties, so be it. Ooh, there's a little bit of lag here, though. Ooh, that's not good. They have suffered over half a million, which is good. They're, they're just slowly dying here, which is awesome. Oh, we've got, still, guys, still got guys down there. So be it. Um, Go repair. I want you to make sure you have capital ships. If you don't have capital ships, you're kind of sunk, so... Hold on. Where are you guys at? Yeah, gun's knocked out. It's not good. What? Hold on. Eight days. What's this? Is zero? I don't understand that. Whatever. There. Strips. Uh, support craft, destroyers, submarines. Oh, I actually researched all the subs. So support craft. The importance of fleet. Fast, maneuverable, long-enduring warships cannot be underestimated. Their flexibility means that beyond providing invaluable defense to convoys, but they're also able to scout enemy movements and aid in attacking enemy fleets. Which is a good thing. Which is a very good thing. Alright, so I can't imagine these guys have that much more manpower. We must have killed tons of them. We have a thousand left. A thousand left. We've lost a quarter million. They've lost 900,000. Actually, really. The enemy's lost. We've lost almost half a million. They've lost over 1.27 million, which is nice. And at this point, let's see. The light tanks, Panzer Expert. Good. You guys are the Pegasi divisions. Pegasus, Pegasi. Light tanks are doing okay ish. I'm going to actually refunnel you guys down this way, maybe, to help take these guys out more quickly. It might help with supply just a little bit. Maybe. Let's we'll see what happens. Now, it's going to be one old big border with uh, the Grafonian Empire. Which will be interesting to take out, but we'll see what happens. Can't imagine they last for too much longer, though, right now. Division wise, they are down to 40 to 60. That's awesome. Yeah, we killed off a lot of enemies here. Holy cow. Do that one. And do that one as well. Jolly good. Down here. We need more military factories. Trying to, We need to build more ships. We need more dockyards too. And then build one right there. Nice. Good stuff. Support craft. Awesome. Barony Brumaire is gone. That's very good. You guys aren't suffering from anything. Go ahead and train then. Oh boy. Oh boy. What's going on? Well, at least we got all of our fleet here. Kind of. Logistics 5. Good. Logistics 6 is just two ahead of time. Ah, fleet being good. That's definitely going to help us out. And then super fire mains. That's definitely going to help us out as well. Let's do the next one. So this way we get even less losses. I know the country's capitulated. Good. Now we could probably send our line tanks here and just help smash everyone here. But how how strong is this group? Lake City. They got quite a few, uh, quite a bit of manpower, quite a few divisions. We're gonna need our full army here to take these guys out. Actually, and about less than three weeks, a little more than two weeks to get, take them out. Follow Catherine, and I'll puppet all of pretty much all these guys. So that'll be good. Any other upgrades? No, disappointing. You guys are training very well. And there's a little bit of lag. Okay, whatever. We need more draconic stuff. We got plenty of light tanks. Ooh, very good. Uh-oh. Sportcraft. Let's see, we sunk two enemy submarinos. Good. Expand the dockyards. Yes, please. So, although our existing shipyards are quite impressive, they still lack the capacity necessary to support our planned naval expansion. We need to construct additional dry docks and repair facilities if we were to meet the upcoming demands. And we sunk another sub. Cool. We'll probably go from there and go right there, see what happens. Path to Zebrica. Zebrica. Awesome, my friends. Thank you very much. Uh, you know what? I'm just going to have annex you guys so we don't have to do that. And then everyone else is going to become a puppet. A very puppety campaign, this one is. Beautiful. All right. Now that we completely surround the state of Lake City, that is what we're going to do. I do want to see Wing Bardi. Literally just Wing Bardi. Gangla Farah. 
Yeah, so broke free because they're under me. Anna Fakari and Golfia Palavecino. Cool. Poach that. These guys then. It'll be the Battle of the Giants. They have so much strength. An insane amount of strength. But we have seven armies. We might need it more, actually. Let's go ahead and train like 12 more to help hold the lines in places we might need. Because we're going to have like. Oh, let's see. Split our army into two, sort of. One uh, up here, another one over here, and send the rest up here, maybe ish. Oh, three towns of Griffiths. Huh. Hmm. Here we go. And we go to war by when? May 10th. Cool. Man, there's some serious lag. Woo! Alright, we built those dockyards up. How about some more dockyards? Uh, is there any place we can build them up in our own lands? That'd be kind of nice. Diplomacy is broken down with the Griffonian Empire. So be it. You know, whatever. Good war boy when May 10th. Good. 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 Alright, before we do that, let's see if we got any more planes. Not really. Not too much. So, one, two, you'll come right here. And then put you guys, doesn't really matter. You put it right there. There you go. Uh, I think we got plenty enough artillery, so let's lower this by 10, maybe. We're gonna need more aluminum for more planes, too. Disperse fighting, good. Lower by 5, lower by 10 more, that's fine. Grab some uh, refineries right there. That'd be great. Grab some of that as well. Make a few more planes. Let's look at ships. We're getting some cruisers. Maybe get another, uh, you know, heavy ship. That'd be kind of nice. Recon threes. How about uh, recon four? That'd be pretty good. Expand the Bacaran shipyard. Silent killers. Battleship models, contested skies, improved bot machines. By striking at our enemies' critical wartime industries, we can cripple their ability to supply troops in the field with equipment. To strike at these well-guarded locations and survive, we must improve the range and durability of our bombers. Yes, please. All right, we got that one done as well. Uh, more attack from cruisers and stuff like that. Let's go ahead and go to war. Call everyone in and have a good time. Lots of allies we have. Are you guys not there yet or something? And y'all take forever. Alright. Two oh, carrier efficiency or sort of organization, which really doesn't help us that much. Yeah, we're pulling all the divisions off the front line with Griffonian Empire, and now we're all moving this way. Give them just a little bit more time, that'll be fine. Three, two, one, zero. My goodness, y'all take forever to get more organization. Holy cow. Uh, I lied. Let's wait. Never mind. Let's go. Air power. Oh, we should have more than enough all over the place. If that's the case, I want to be prepared for this, this, this. That'd be good. Make sure the entire front line has, like, infrastructure, because we're going to need all these supplies, man. Oh, boy, we got stuff over there, too, we got to be concerned about. I also grab this place down here just so we can build up some more radar. Now, these guys should be crumbling pretty easily. Like, that's a big border. They don't have nearly the army that they need to have defend it all, but, you know, that's just me. Uh, guys, I believe I have selected you. There you go. Lots of losses for the enemies. 25,000 for us. Over 100,000 for them. The fall of Lake City. What a shame. What a shame. What a shame. Alright, you guys. Here's what I'm going to do with y'all. You five are going to be fighting over the river here, so you guys come over there. That'd be good. More military factories. Great. I'll deal with them very soon. Not yet, though. You guys can come over here as well. Uh, actually, you know what? We're going to stack you guys up a little higher, like that. Because the tanks are going to hang out here, too. It's only t seven tank divisions, but you know what? It's better than nothing. And these are our hills, so fighting defensively shouldn't be too bad. Go ahead and do whatever you need to do. 36, 37. 400,000 losses for the enemies. Not bad. Uh, Anti-tank can be the catch-all. Another marine division, very delightful. 
please get down to that area. And they only have up to 50 divisions left. Taking over half a million casualties, over 600,000, is pretty good for us. And they have fallen. Now I'm going to puppet them. I'd love to integrate them, but I don't think it's possible. We're just going to take them all out first, and then we'll release them. Barad Majocracy. Barony Brumaire. Huh? Now we're going to keep them. Lushi. There we go. Now, does anyone else have claims on these on this place? It's supposed to be Lushi. Uh, this technically was part of Lake City for a while, so I'm just going to give it to these guys. And how about Hellquill? I'll give it to you. Because why not? The Republic of Lake City. Cool. Oh! Daedra Sky. That's kind of cool. Oh, you got a lot of manpower. That's good. Pony power. Scraping the barrel, of course. And y'all are doing okay as well, so... Very cool. So now we gotta split these guys up, which I don't want to do. So we got that covered. We're gonna need like one. You know what? Actually, I'm gonna focus up here first, maybe. One, two, three, four. Leave two out. Put them under someone else. Oh, uh, more attack, recovery. Oh, that's pretty good. Yeah, I'm not even gonna look at anyone else. There you go. The south shall rise again. Not really. Maybe. We'll see what happens. But you guys come over here. There you go. This way we are good and ready for whatever may come. Hopefully we'll just be defending for a while though. Need a train, go right ahead. Improve bomber designs, very nice. Improve plating, so silent killers. The flexibility and cost effectiveness of naval mines ranks this an attractive tool for both defensive and offensive operations. Developing mining technology further would allow us to make even more effective use of these devices. Good, recruit someone else. Region wide integration, always good to get. If you can get some more military factories, I would be very appreciative of that. Thank you. Mm, there's really nowhere else we could really want to build them. We could build them for a puppet. But then again, it's not that useful for us then. Welcome into the fold. Ooh, lightning fives. Cool. Alright, light tank 5s, and then we'll do some modern tanks, but we can't get there quite yet. We can do that modern tank, but we'll get to modern tank 4s instead. Basic amphibious tanks, I think we're okay. This stuff is... eh, you might as well do it. Why not? How much armor do these guys have? 60, that's... You know what? Hmm. Not bad. Armor? 75? Can you imagine getting 75 armor on a light tank? I can. Bracket shooting, huh? Can we get any more resource efficiency gain yet? Not really, but we're gonna... Oh, it's only 5% more construction speed? Oh, that sucks. Wish it was more than that, but whatever. People are training, learning, doing well. Yeah, the south is probably gonna have a few issues down here. We're probably gonna need a few more divisions than the, the two armies we gave them. Because this is looking pretty strong over here. Over here, we're looking... Well, we're looking pretty okay. Not bad, but not great. And we go to war whenever we want. I'm waiting for that first group, though, to be made. Let's get some more entrenchment. That'd be good. Uh, you guys. Uh, I really don't want to plop you out too early. Y'all will be done soon enough, hopefully. Let's see. I'm going to war with anyone else. No. No. There, my puppet. No. That's big sadness. Hmm. Everyone in the, over here, except for the, like these few nations, they're pretty fiercely independent, not gonna lie. Fiercely independent. No. Dread League? No. Oh, that's sad. Go to war by when? 13th? Cool. It's 13th of September. Silent Killers. Improved plating. So, our heavy warships represent enormous investments of time, effort, and resources. We must do all we can to protect them. It is imperative that we improve our designs to make use of the latest technologies and improve the armors of our cruisers. Armors? Armor of our cruisers. Good. Do that one. Subsidiary carrier roll. That one, too. We at least have one more ship, right? Uh, yes. Good. I want you all to come down here. You never know what might go on down here. But I definitely do not want to get involved with uh, their navy, the enemy's navy. All right, they should be finished soon-ish. August 28th. So in about two weeks, we'll have that done. 
And then we'll go to war with the Griffonian Empire because we need to make sure that we have enough divisions down here. Because this oh, is looking pretty, looking pretty weak. Not gonna lie, looking pretty darn weak down here. Uh, that's a case. Try giving some forts down here. That's fine. Air base is looking okay-ish, maybe. Any other planes down here, maybe. Uh, we got plenty of fighters. Three, right there. Good. Good, good. Uh, throw you all right here, except for you two. There you go. That should help out a little bit. Uh, where are those divisions? Oh, they're over here. Okay. It's only eight, which really sucks. I wish we had more, but whatever. Uh, get a better general. We'll get a general. Uh, yeah. Artemis Rosamund. Better artillery. Yeah, that next one we're going to wait a little bit on. Over here, that's fine. Get over there. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. Because we're going to go to war whether you're there or not. We've got plenty of allied divisions, but mm, we'll see what happens. We'll definitely see what happens. Because this is going to be the final thing we do in this campaign. You're there yet? Uh, you actually are sort of there, which is good. Go and go to war. See what happens. Oh, wait. Hold on. Don't go to war yet. You're still training. There we go. This might have been a bad idea, but whatever. Well, will see. And they immediately attack me on the front lines. Oh, no. Our allies are attacking them as well. Their attacks are going to fail, and their attacks against us are probably going to fail as well. Over here, we're seeming to hold out for the most part. Maybe not everywhere. Pretty close, though. Oh, our allies have some modern tanks, too. Cool. Definitely a bloodbath. Water Towns, have you joined us yet? Uh, yes, you have. Good. Nice. And where are we not getting our stuff from? Let's find and lower it for now. Get it from the Kingdom of Wing body. Asterion. Oh, that's our puppet. Oh. No, 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 Good. Alright, not bad so far. We've lost 20, 30,000 versus half oh, a million. Wow, that's pretty fast. Improved plating. How about we get Kotal Kotalia shipyards? The naval base of Kotalia is crucial to maintaining our strategic readiness. Expansion of the site's facilities would allow it to effectively serve as a secondary shipyard if most other naval dockyards were to come under attack. Which is a good thing. This is a lot of, uh, a lot of death. Holy crap. Do you see oh my goodness. That, those casualties, though. Holy cow. I mean, yeah, it looks like they're winning in some places, maybe. But, oh my goodness. At what cost? They've already taken a million casualties. They're running out of ma- Oh my goodness. Look at the pony power just dropping like rocks. That's amazing. I can't wait to counterattack. Okay, they're out. It went so fast, the game counter couldn't even keep up with it. They've lost. Almost roughly one and a half million people already. Well, I guess it's time for us to push then. Now, we might not be able to win immediately. That's okay. We do have air superiority, looks like, so. And I don't think we have Nibuzia. We don't have that one yet, so that sucks. Navy's trying to do a little something something here, which is kind of nice. Oh, we're actually pushing down here too. I forgot we have Marines. Uh, let's keep an eye on this. They've already almost lost two million. They have 664 division. Almost over 700 in total. Oh my goodness, they've already lost over 2 million. Now, I know our guys are suffering quite a bit. And we've lost, like, quite a few guys ourselves. But, uh... Holy cow. I know I should really probably micromanage this, but at this point... They're literally on scraping the barrel, so... Yeah. The Grand Duchy of Fedezia... Actually, all of our allies have done a very good job. Wing Body, Republic of Asterion, the Kingdom of Hellquill... We've, take, we've killed off a million ourselves, but... 
Our puppets are no uh, laughing matter. Like, they know how to do a good job. Oh, actually, they have a little bit of re air resistance up there. That's fine. Uh, they can't replace their losses, so the more losses they take... I'm sure they get stuff every month, but... It ain't gonna be enough for them. Now, we might get encircled here, actually, which is not a good thing, but... With their divisions flooding in, we should do okay. Oh, look at this, an encirclement. a beautiful thing to, to see, I'd say. There we go, good. Over three million dead... Oh, we're just breaking out here using our tanks. Oh, this might be a little bit too fast for us. Well, before we continue, does anyone have upgrades? No. No, I'm actually a little surprised. We don't have any upgrades yet. No, that's okay. House of Airy, Airy has capitulated. Very good, very good. Uh, no, we good, guys. We are good. I'm gonna assume maybe... I'll say a million losses for us in total. Because to take out the rest of this continent, pretty much... Takes quite a few guys, or ponies. Warp up again would be nice, because we wouldn't do war bonds. Good. No, uh, we're pretty good. Do we have any things we need to look out for besides dragon equipment and fall of Achilia? Achilla. We've almost linked up here, too. It's pretty nice. What's going on over here? I shall think of their navy. Do we feel confident enough to actually throw our navy in here? Uh, you know what, let's try it. Screw being weak down there. We're gonna come over here. Oh, another ship. Don't mind if I do. Ground attack initiative, great. Another barony has capitulated. More agility would be very nice. Uh, looking pretty good so far. We might have actually lost a delight tank. That is not good. Oh, yeah, they, they have... Oh, we're gonna lose the tank divisions. That's bad, that's bad, that's bad, that's bad. Get back, get back, get back. Yeah, we're gonna lose our tank divisions, my bad. That's my fault. Oof. They were doing so well, but then they got encircled. You know what? I hate to do this, but it is what it is. Uh, I'm gonna retire you right now. Uh, go hang out over here. I don't know why. Why did you stay so small? There you go. Stay like that. Come on, guys, I need you to push a little harder than this. This is kind of pathetic. I mean, if you look at their divisions, they're looking all injured. They're literally all injured. They've already taken over 4 million losses. Gutali Shipyards, very nice. Uh, refined warship or battleship designs. Battleships are of enormous importance to the morale of their soldiers, being symbols of our naval dominance and representing the might of our nation. However, we must also ensure they are properly equipped and be able to hold their own in naval engagements. To this end, we shall begin the process of upgrading, modernizing, and battleship designs. Well, we're kind of already there. That's okay. Look at all these guys. Look how weak some of these guys are. They are giving us a run for our money, but, hmm, still. Still. And this will take quite a few guys to help put down any sort of resistance, but that's okay. Occupy territories. Yeah, we already have those guys. The other house of Airy has capitulated. Good. Plenty of guns, plenty of magical equipment, plenty of armored cars. Looking real nice. How many more losses can they afford? I bet they can't afford that much more. They still have a massive number of divisions, but with no manpower and slowly losing maybe some fuel, hopefully. That'd be good. Actually, how much fuel do they have? That's supply. Fuel? Oh, they got plenty enough in the north for now. We're not seeing too many enemy ships, which kind of sucks. Go over there. See what you can do. Losses are probably at least a million for us. Ah, oh, we're not quite there yet. We're getting there. They lost over five million. I wish this this would hurry up, but whatever. Not much you can really do about it. Except like enjoy. They're literally doing. They have to be doing like last stand or desperate defense. It's because the onslaught is just insane. Ah, oh, golden target. Yes, you anything for us? You're level four, almost level five. Anything over there? Nope. Ah, uh, flight risk. You're an ambusher. Oh, all right then. I and mean, we can try to keep... Like, they are literally defending to the last guy. Which is great to see, because... It'd be very easy to kill them off later on. Like, if we were to really subjugate them. But this is this is just brutal. Literal brute force. We've killed, we've killed 4 million of them, ourselves. It's very nice. 5% more uh, gain? Not bad, not bad. 
you know what? Instead of getting it from you, actually, uh, yeah. Instead of getting it from you, get it from, uh, what the heck? Appaloosian protector. Oh. Um, with that flag, I am very interested in what they're up to right now. Main hat and protector. Oh, protector! It's oh, hello, protectress Lil lilac. Oh my goodness, that is Governor Protector. Um, I hope they get a uh, focus tree eventually. That looks that really intrigues me. Southern ponies, huh? Fighting a war of northern aggression. Hmm. Hmm. You always discover something new when you play Equestria at War. Always something new. They've lost over six million now. Yeah, six and a half million. That's what I kind of thought. And how much are we getting a month? I'm so surprised we haven't found any enemy ships. So come on, man. You guys prepare if you need to, but Jesus. I mean, come on, guys. This is a massive war, but oh, look how weak their divisions are in some places. Oh my goodness, that's so beautiful. All right, let's do this. Y'all going to have to defend up here. Oh. I don't know why when you independently click that, it still doesn't work to, like, cover the line. Don't make sense sometimes. Just don't. That's fine. Just defend whatever you need for now. It's fine. Just give us what we need. Refine battleship designs. Examine the Marine Corps. The Bakar and Marine Corps boast a long and proud tradition. Our Marines have historically taken their mission very, mission very seriously. Nonetheless, we should conduct a thorough review of the branch's practices and make sure they are paid, prepared to fulfill their critical roles in amphibious warfare force. Sounds good, like a good idea to me. Olinian operative? Sure. Alright, at this point, it doesn't look like you're really learning that much. You're level 3, which is nice. You're level 3, though. 1, 2, 3. Come over here. Let's stop attacking and prepare ourselves. Just get organized, everyone. One unified command. We've taken a million losses ourselves. They've taken seven times our casualties. Not bad, not bad. We'll get some planning bonus, and then we will strike out once again. They have no manpower, which is a good thing. Oh, no, 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 no. What are you doing? What do you think you're doing? No, 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 no. Hunter killer groups, good. We could annex them, but we're not going to. Any shippies? Nope. On your mark. Some of you are still getting set. Come on. Actually, five, six, five, four, four, six. Eh, I wish they were actually a little stronger than that, but whatever. Anything, anything, sort of. Oh, Katarina? Yes, good. Exactly what we want to see. Three. Oh, convoy. See what you can do. Not going to be a lot of winning yet, but that's okay. You're trying to drain them of all the resources. They got plenty of planes though, which is not very good for us. Uh, air bases. Do we have any other planes we can throw up in the air? Well, we found a hundred here. Uh, is there any good or large air base that we took? That we might have under us. No. Okay. I know it's too many, but that's okay. There you go. And then there you go. And then there you go. So you all can split out, split up. All the good stuff. Over here, bombers. Let's grab you. Nice. And I'll put them both right. Uh, not there. there. There you go. We might not win every battle, but that's okay. I'm not planning to win every battle. I'm just planning to kill them all off as best we can. You guys, your infrastructure, your supply here is so bad. I have to do something about it. Put some radar around there if you can. Ace by the promoted, very good. I thought we'd take over a million casualties, so. Nothing unexpected. Taking even more now. They've almost take eight million. Good. Oh, they annexed Vadina, huh? Interesting, interesting. 
Seems like we could probably use a good old thing of slavery here once we're done. Oh, do you have an upgrade? Yes, you do. Own yielding defender isn't bad. I'm going to go with infantry expert just because that helps 5% more attack from infantry. That's some good stuff. At least we got into one major conflict before this campaign ended, and I'm happy about that. Convoy sailing, very cool. Very good. Naval mission efficiency, sure, why not? Oh, more divisions. Throw them right there, that's fine. We don't need any more. Save on that uh, pony power. Good, 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 good. Nice. Not sure why it keeps going to that direction, but whatever. We got Rilla. Rilla? Good. Examine the Marine Corps. Both land and sea. Old salty sea dogs. Recovery rate. That's just for everyone, though. Special forces attack. I kind of like that. So the infantry combat abilities of our Marines means that they are a formidable force on land as well as at sea. Superior mobility and flexibility, flexibility allows them to fulfill numerous roles across the battlefield. Very, very good. Now, do we link up here? We have not yet. That's fine. At this point, I think the army isn't quite shattered, but it's pretty close to shattering. They have lost at least a two thirds of their entire armor, armed forces. Nine million casualties in total so far for them. Not enough. Just hopefully in time for us to get down here. Um, what are you, Nimbusia? Did this can get reset? Oh no, it's 27 days. Oh, we're doing both at the same time. I thought we had it already done. Huh? Ooh, ships. Yeah, I really wish we could find more ships here. Anything over here? Region 1 integration. Do some of that. Uh, never did, didn't, didn't use nukes in this campaign. That's okay, though. They don't always have to use nukes. Yeah, their army's pretty much dead at this point. Sure, they got still a lot of divisions, but... Can they really put up an effective force against us? Maybe up here? Because supply so bad, but... I don't know. I'm going to retire you guys back to the Rebel Federation. Home military police. Look at that. So weak. Yeah, okay, now look, they've lost in 150 divisions. That's so nice. Now less than 140? 130? 125? The number keeps going up and down. I'm not really sure what, what it's doing right now. Uh, oh, come on. Can we say less than 100 divisions? Less than 100 divisions. Come on, come on, come on. Are we still up? Oh, that sucks. That went up back up to A3. Hey, we did it! It only cost us like 1.2 million of our own casualties, but you know what? No one is counting. Uh, I'm just going to go ahead and... How's, you know what? I'm going to take you guys out. I don't really know what the feud is between these two at the time of this recording, but that's okay. Uh, Griponian Empire. You know what? I'm going to take all these states and see if we can like liberate them under one big old government or something. I wish... I, can I become the Griponian Empire? That'd be kind of cool. But I don't think we're Griffins, so... Now that's nice. But let's end this campaign with a good reduction. Where's the Griffonian Republic? Lots of Iri, Ir. Oh, can I not? Oh, maybe I can return. Ah, oh, return territory. Griffonian Northern Region, Griffonian Republic. Um, anything else down here? Ah, Griffonian Empire. And Greenback? No, we good. And this is all core territory, so we're not going to do that. Um, I guess Fethizia, since they are our territory. See what happens? Now that's a big old grand duchy. Big old grand one. Uh, let's see. Let's release the Republic. No one should be too strong so they could overthrow us. Let's see. One, two, three. Eerie. Oh, they're fighting over the same. Some pieces of the dirt, huh? Kingdom of Achilia. We could try that, yeah. Uh, yeah, I guess so too. That's fine. Medina, it's fine. Gonna make all these people very weak. Cool! So, this is now the River Federation. This continent is looking pretty good, even though the other continent looks like it's overrun with changelings. But before we leave, nice flag led by this person, Elsa. Led by Sandra. Led by Anna. Led by Sarah. Sarah, Sarah. Ina Brunier. The Griffonian Republic led by Alexandra Kamersky. Which is who is early in the game. 
uh, Anna Graco, and then Gabriella. Cool, but that's going to be our entire campaign, my friends. If you enjoyed the campaign, consider leaving a like, subscribe if you're new, check out my Discord link in the description below, and I will see you all tomorrow in a different campaign. Thank you very much for watching, and have a great rest of your day.